everyone, I'm Lala Bad. Welcome today. I'm so excited. I'm so excited, y'all. Sephora sale. It happened. The VIB sale. It happened. I think this is the last sale of this year. If you were an uh, insider, you got 10% off. If you were VIB, you got 15% off. And if you were a Rouge member, you got 20% off. And I know you're thinking 20%, it ain't 50%. I know. They should get, I feel like they should give, like those numbers should go higher for everybody involved. But they don't. They ain't going to. And I don't, I don't see it in the future. Regardless, it's a big sale. And this is the time when these sales happen. This is the time where you go all out, girl. And you treat yourself, sis. And it just so happens that this sale happens around my birthday months. And I went in, y'all. So this is birthday haul number three. Without further ado, let's get into it. All right, <laughs> I got that out my system. I'm not gonna be trying on any of these products, but do stay tuned because I will be doing videos for these products. I want to start off this this haul um, with a separate haul. It's a very small haul that I picked up from Nordstrom's Rack. Girl, they have an online store, and I check it every day. If you're a makeup fanatic like myself, check it every day. You will get great deals. So let me just show you what I got, all right? The first thing I picked up was this thing here. This is Milk Makeup. Y'all know. I love me some milk. That might be my second favorite makeup brand, Milk Makeup. And this is the Blur and Set Setting Powder. At, at Sephora, I believe it's 20 something. Um, I did see it at TJ Maxx, um, and I believe it was $14.99. But at Nordstrom's Rack Clearance, it was only $14. And it's in the color Translucent Medium. I'm going to just show you really quickly what it looks like. Yeah, $14. And it was free shipping because I am a Nordy member. Remember I told y'all sign up for the emails? Yeah. Become a Nordy member. There are perks, girl. <laughs> and then the biggest item, girl, this is this is like several items within an item. Okay. Let me just show you. I'm just shut up to show you. This here i'm so excited this is the naked urban decay honey honey drop vault this usually is priced at 100 so i'll put it right here how much is, it was like for all of it this whole thing how much it is girl i only got it for 50 bucks 50 bucks is not used brand new it was sealed packaged i took that part off but these are all the products you get in it basically a pr package Girl, the whole vault, $50. Look. Y'all come look at this. Come look at this. This is the Honey Urban Decay Scented Sparkling Body Powder. This is the Urban Decay Honey Eyeshadow Primer Potion. This is the Urban Decay Honey Lip Plumper. The Honey Setting Spray. The Urban Decay Honey Palette. And I really never really thought anything about Like, I just, I seen it. I thought it was pretty. I really didn't think it was going to show up on me. But I swatched. Girl. The shimmers alone, honey. The shimmers alone, girl. Oh. The shimmers alone have, they, this palette has touched me. In places I ain't never been touched. <laughs> Moving on to the Sephora haul. Sephora sale VIB haul. Let me show you the samples. The samples I picked up are the Pharmacy Honeymoon Glow. This is a night serum. Beauty Blender Sample Foam. There's liquid and you're supposed to mix it together. Um, I one size fits off, go off, juiciest makeup remover. I think you get one wipe. And this Toche Eclat High Coverage 
Radiant Concealer by um, YSL. It's a sample. I um, cashed in, I believe, 200 points or 100 points. I don't remember. For this here, this is the Miss Dior Blooming Bouquet by by Dior. And it's a, it's a big sample size. not like a little mini, but it's so cute. And it smells so good. I want the big one now. I want the big one now. It sold me. That's it. I'm done. I want the big one. <laughs> Moving on to the actual haul. So I picked a lot of things that I knew that if it, I didn't have a discount on, I was not going to ever get in my lifetime. So let's get started. First thing I picked up was this Milk Flex Concealer. If you saw my TJ Maxx haul recently, which was yesterday, you saw that I found some concealers. And I think that I'm going to be returning this back to Sephora because I found them at TJ Maxx for a lot cheaper than this sale price. So definitely this will be going back. The next item is this Velour. This is the Velour Lash and Go Eyeliner and Lash Adhesive. It is basically an eyeliner that is lash glue and it's the best out there. I've heard many reviews about all the other ones, all the affordable ones. This is the best, so I picked it up. I picked up this here. This is the Rare Beauty Lip and Cheek Two-Piece Mini Duo. And uh, you get, I wanted to try the blush. I really just wanted to try it. They are small. Um, here's a battery, a AA battery, just so you can see the, the, the size. But I will swatch. Here is the lippy. Let's see how much product you get for a mini. That much product. I'm gonna swatch you for you. Mm, that's a pretty color. And then this is a blush. Again, it's it's small. It's a mini. It looks very light. Now I was looking for. Ooh, that feels like a like a silicone almost. That's a pretty color. Yeah, I'll, I'll, you know, it's just to try it. I picked up this here. This is the Cover FX um, Power Play Foundation. This is in the sale section of Sephora. Um, and I got it in the color G plus six zero. Y'all know I had to pick up the Huda Beauty Stick. The Huda Beauty Faux Filter Skin Finish foundation stick buildable coverage i got it in the color macchiato i originally got it in a darker color and i just went back today to go exchange it there was no hassle they gave me the color and i was on my way did not spend too much time in sephora because there was no sale today uh but again it's in macchiato and i'll open that up so you can see a swatchy swatch so excited ah so cute so it feels really smooth um I'll put that like right here. Ooh, you can barely see it. When you can barely see it, it's meant to be. Look at that. I picked up the Makeup by Mario. This is the Master Metals Eyeshadow Palette. These, This is that palette that is all the shimmers that you throw in a mixing a medium. And it's like a liquid eyeshadow. You, yeah, I don't know if y'all seen it. You go to Sephora. Look at the video. It's amazing, and I had to have it. This was the only thing in this line that touched my soul. Look at that. Oh, so pretty. And they have a mixing tray here. Let me just do a swatch, see if it, you could even see. Ooh, girl. Mm. Ooh, can you imagine these wet? Uh -uh. Yeah, girl. And I, of course, had to buy the mixing medium. You get the spatula. And here's the mixing medium and the spatula. And in the palette, again, there's like this dip. You see the dip? Um, it gives you that tray. So, like, if you want to mix and you got to, you know, work with it, you could just pick, have it in here. Um, and then there's another place where you, I guess you can mix it. I don't know. But there's that. I knew I wanted to pick up a bronzer. I did want to pick up the Dior bronzer quad, but I just didn't feel like the colors were dark enough for me. And they had three other colors that I knew I would never touch. So I didn't go that route. Instead, I picked up this bronzer here. This is the Gucci 
pour the butte eclat sole it's a bronzing powder by Gucci and um, it's in the color three this I believe they had four colors I want to say and I picked up the second to the last this is what she comes looking like oh my god it's so fancy y'all it's like it's like so again the Sephora sells the time to get these types of things because you want that discount but look like there she goes ah I'm excited. I'll, I'll, let me see my swatchy swatchy. She might do. She might do. <laughs> I, I'm girl. I'm so excited to get to use that. I'm, I can't wait. So I don't have anything Gucci in my life. Do I have Gucci perfume? I don't even think I got Gucci perfume. Um, and then I was like looking up Gucci and they don't even all they make are lip balms, lipsticks, and this the bronzers. It's so odd. Like why a bronzer like i don't know but whatever all right <laughs> the next two items were items that i was fighting i didn't know which one to get um i was calling everybody and a mama to help me choose and i just decided it's my birthday month it's the end of the year we've had a shitty year when are you going to get these palettes on 20 percent off what not until what I don't know when the next sale is in Sephora. So, I picked up the Huda Beauty Naughty Palette. Oops, this way. The Huda Beauty Naughty Palette. Y'all know I love Huda Beauty. I really just like her formulas. I really, really do. Some people ain't feeling her, but I'm feeling her, and it's this me. So, um, now, the reason why I, I didn't know if I was going to get her or not was because I feel like I own some of the shadows that are in here. Let me show you. So this palette, I own this palette, the Huda Booty Nude. And just take a look at the color story, right? Let me open this one. And here's this color story. Um, some of them are similar, like the dark one. I mean, I feel like all of them are similar, right? But... Um, they have these marble shades in this one, and then this one right here, it's like a clear gel, and but it has those balls of color, so it's like a, like a pink gel-like gloss finish. And then this one, for sure, was going back and forth, going back and forth, talking to my girls, talking to my makeup friends, talking to my mom. I t did I talk to Rue about it? And, um, I, I think I told him I want this and he was like, get it. Um, <laughs> he doesn't care, but girl, and I even saw videos. I saw videos. People asked me if I was going to get it. I was trying to say, no, I'm not going to get it because it's too much money. But then I, you know, looked at the weight. I looked at the price. I looked at the prices again, went back and forth with a friend. Me and my friend were on the phone. We was talking about it. We was like really trying to justify the purchase <laughs> because we didn't, I really didn't want to, no one to say, no, no, get it. I want to give a shout out. First of all, <laughs> to Tish, cause she asked me if I was going to get it. I told her, no girl, I lied. I am so sorry. I usually am not in the business of lying girl, but I got it girl. I got it. This is the Natasha Denona Trio Chrome Palette. And by the way, Natasha Denona, for some reason, when I was like on the edge and the, the verge of buying it, she gets on and starts doing swatches. Bitch. Sephora sale is over. I think I am done shopping at Sephora until next year. I know I'm lying, right? And um, I hope that you liked this video. I hope that it was helpful. And if you shop the sale, let me know in the comments what you got. I'd really like to know what you got. How did you treat yourself? And if you haven't treated yourself and you're a mom and, and, and you know, you're always giving, girl, take one day out of the week. You don't got to buy something expensive, but definitely treat yourself. If, if it has to do with just sitting down, reading a book outside for a couple hours, do it. If it's grabbing you a Starbucks coffee and sitting at a park or even sitting at your car in your car, listening to the radio or watching YouTube, do it. If it's going to the Dollar Tree and doing a small haul, 
do it. If it's going to Dollar Tree buying makeup or Dollar General buying makeup, do it. If it's if it if it's going to Rainbow or Ross or Burks or disc, whatever discount store to go buy you a t-shirt or a pair of pajamas or some underwear, Victoria's Secret, girl, do it. Treat yourself because you are everything to your household. You do so much and do too much. And you need to relax, take time, and take care of yourself. All right, everyone. God bless. I love you guys. Bye.